Here's a Lapco dual tank stock. So we can see here's the ASA on the stock with an on off. And then we have a cage that holds the two tanks in it. Here's our mount screw or our Allen screw to lock the two tanks in the stock. And then we can see that each of the tanks has a siphon tube in it. The tanks are from 89 and 92. So sometime after February 92, this was produced. As we unscrew our tank, we can see that there is our siphon tube. Pulls from the very center. It's made out of brass. Pretty bizarre. Screw it back in. I believe both of these tanks have one of those tubes in them. This tank might be... No. So they both have that siphon tube on them. It's not anti-siphon because it does pull liquid, so it's siphoning the liquid. It is anodized ghost color. Here's the second tank ASA stock. Again, it has an on-off. It's a big, long piece of aluminum with a butt plate from maybe the micro ASA shoved on the end. It could take three tanks, but it is has a plug on the third one to prevent them from being put on. So right now it's just a tool tank stock. If we tank one of these tanks off, this tank is 89. The other tank is also 89. This one could be earlier, but chances are it was also produced around 92, maybe 93. And during that time, Lapco, I think, would have been located in San Diego through Paintball Connection. We can see again, has a siphon tube there. And a another siphon tube here. Pretty neat. Put it back together. There we go.